Hello everyone and welcome to Epix's 1986 title World Games. Adapted for the Master System in 1989, this game allows us to compete in four different sports events based on a, well, sort of realistic national sports. First of all, we get to name ourselves and choose which nation to represent. And, well, if the USSR is available, that is naturally the only choice. The first sport we will be participating in is barrel jumping, which, according to this game, is popular in Germany. Barrel jumping is more of a hobby than a sport, really. And I've never quite figured out why you would actually spend time doing this. The uh, gameplay here is simple enough. You choose the number of barrels, you press, you alternately press left and right, and then press A to jump, and down to land. And that was a world record, by the way. It should be mentioned that Pressing left and right alone, as you can see here, is not enough. You have to time the presses and begin slowly and then speed up as you start gaining momentum. Simply hammering back and forth results in the character doing what most closely resembles a silly little dance. We are rewarded with a gold medal and the Soviet National Anthem for our brilliant 12-barrel jump. Next up is the caper toss, the traditional Scottish sport of, well, tossing capers. Huh. Another sport I'm not entirely sure how they dis why they decided to include here, seeing as, well, it is entirely Scottish. And not much like in the previous game, what you do here is uh, have your toe smashed by a caber. You alternate left and right, and with the correct timing, press A to begin the throw. Ho hold down A to get the right angle and toss. The world record, according to the game, by the way, is 20 feet, which means that I have already broken a second world record today. And crushed both my feet. The third sport is Canadian log rolling, which most people are more familiar with from certain Wild West movies from the 50s and 60s. I honestly don't think that log rolling is even recognized as a sport these days. Oh well, let's get on with it. Again, it comes down to alternating left and right, and once again, if you simply hammer left and right, you fall off. You have to begin slowly and then increase your momentum, similarly as in the ba barrel jumping. And, well, that's it basically. I have no idea exactly how this is scored, nor do I have any idea what actually decides whether the AI falls off. I suspect the game designers aren't entirely sure either. That was apparently worth 83 points, and seeing as the official world record before this was 35, I have broken yet another world record. Winning quickly apparently only nets me 19 points, for reasons unknown. Another sport, another gold. The fourth and final sport in world game is bull riding, 
which admittedly is a real sport of sorts, I guess. Or is it? I honestly don't know anymore. Let's just get started. The bull riding sequence is simple enough, I suppose. While the bull is spinning, hold down, and then press either left or right on your direction pad, depending on which direction the bull is turning. Sounds easy enough? Well, it's not. Scoring is based on which bull you ride and... well, that's basically it. This means that if you happen to choose one of the easier bulls, it is literally impossible to break the world record of 35 points. I find it quite impressive how my roadier riding co cowboy here manages to actually bounce off the back of the bull's head onto the back again. This was the final goal for today, which nets me 4 of 4. And checking the world records, turns out that I am the world record holder in each and every sport of the World Games. Thank you for watching and look forward to my next short LP. Thank you.